your desire exists as a reality and you accept, you accept and assume that it is yours and it is done. And when you start applying this law to all of your manifesting techniques, you are going to see incredible results. Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Juliette Cleary. And if you're new here, make sure to subscribe and tap that bell icon for upcoming videos and give this video a thumbs up for me. Law of Assumption. I've been seeing a lot of people talk about Law of Assumption. I've had people asking me about the Law of Assumption and what it really means and how is it really different from the Law of Attraction. The Law of Assumption is something that I use with every manifesting process. And it's something that without using the words, the law of assumption, I've been talking about on this channel all along. So the law of assumption says that you assume that your desire, your goal is done. It's done and it's yours. It exists. So this desire exists as a reality. Now it's on a certain frequency and all you have to do is tune to the frequency of that desire, just like you're tuning to a specific radio station. Now make sure you stay till the end of the video because I'm gonna give you a process that will help you speed up manifesting by a hundred times. Now if you do all of your manifesting processes from this place of assuming that what you want is yours, it's yours, it's done, it's a reality, you're gonna get results a lot faster. There is a big difference between, you know, if you're doing, let's use visualization as an example. If you're using visualization and you're coming at it from a place of, you know, this thing isn't mine. I'm trying to make it mine. I'm trying to make it come to me, but it's not mine and it's not done yet. I'm creating it. I need to bring it into my life, right? There's a huge difference between going about it like that or visualizing something because you know it's yours, you know it's done, it's a reality, it's energy exists, and you're just tuning to the frequency of it using visualization. That is a huge distinction. Everything in this universe is energy. And all energy vibrates at a certain frequency. Have a look around you wherever you are. Every object that you can see is energy vibrating. Every object around you has a frequency. It is energy that is constantly moving. And the same goes for every single thing that you have asked for, whether it's a physical thing or whether it's, you know, an aspect of yourself, you know, you know a habit, positive habit that you want to have, a skill, um, something you want in your relationship with your partner. It doesn't matter what it is. Everything is energy. What you want exists in an energetic form. The energy of what you want is real and it is done. You just need to tune your energy to match its energy and boom, it's going to be in your life. So imagine if you were visualizing what you wanted. You're imagining this ideal thing that you're wanting, but you're doing it from that place of it's mine. This is mine. This is done. It's mine. That's so huge. Your energy, your vibration is super pure. You're on a higher frequency as opposed to when you're visualizing saying, I really, you know, thinking I really want this to happen or, you know, trying to feel like you, you don't feel like it's yours. You don't feel like it's done and you're trying to make it happen or make it come to you. If you choose to accept that what you want is already created, its energy exists, it's a reality, it is yours. And now visualize, now do the scripting, now do the affirmations, knowing that it's yours. Now you're going to see fast results. And so now I'm going to give you a little bit of a process. Okay. So every single time that you are, you know, visualizing, you're writing an affirmation, you're speaking an affirmation, or whatever it is, I want you to think about it in terms of it's done. Because when I ask, the universe answers. It is mine. Every single time you are visualizing, scripting, saying affirmations, I want you to think about it like that. Like this is real, it's done. It is mine. Everything I want is mine. I am just tuning to the frequency of it, but I've chosen it 
and it's mine. And this is what I do when I write down affirmations in the morning. Okay, I will write it as if I already have it. Like I am sure, I am certain that I have this thing or I am grateful that I have this desire, whatever it is. But when I write that and I speak it out loud as well, when I write that, I write it from a place of I'm certain, I'm certain that I have this thing because I know it exists, I know it is mine and I know the universe delivers everything that I want to me. If you do it from that vibration, that attitude, that feeling place, you're going to start to really feel confident that what you want is yours and then it won't be a long time before it actually is in your reality in a way that you can experience it with your senses. So that's how I want you to think about all of your desires as they exist, but you can't experience it with your senses just yet because you're still tuning, you know, your um, frequency to match its frequency. Okay. But it's real and it's yours and it exists. Come at it with that feeling, that knowing, that knowing that the universe takes care of everything for you. And that you don't have to worry about it. That's what I, that's how I do my manifesting processes. It's not something that I'm trying to get, but something that is already mine that I'm just aligning with, that I'm just tuning my frequency to. Now you're at a completely different vibration. You're at a super high frequency because you are accepting and assuming that this is yours. It's yours already. I am certain. I am sure I am grateful that I have this thing. I am certain, I am 100% certain that I have this thing. That I have, you know, thinking about it like I have created this thing because I have asked for it. It's done, it's lined up for me. So of course it's mine. And trust me, the more that you do this, the more that you do your manifesting processes from that place and you're affirming, you're consistently affirming and assuming this is mine, this is already mine. Of course this is mine, like I know. I know that this is mine. I know that this is done, you know, on a vibrational level, this is done. You're going to start believing more and more in what you want. You're gonna have that confidence, that clarity, that you can be anything and you can do anything and you can have anything that you choose. And this is not just me saying, okay, well, just, you know, pretend like it is done. No, it is done. It is done. What you want is done. It exists. If you can think, you know, if you can want it, if you can ask for it, it's done. It's real. It's a reality. And now that you've chosen it, all you have to do is line up with it. It is done. The universe delivers every single time for everything that you want. And the thing is, no one can take what you want, what you have asked for and created. No one can take it away from you. It's yours. It is yours and it will be right there around the corner waiting, ready for you whenever you choose to line up with it. It's not going anywhere. And after you do your manifesting process from that place of assuming it is mine, it's done. It's mine, I'm certain. I'm certain that I have this thing because I'm a powerful creator and the universe always delivers what I want. After you're done with whatever, you know, if it was an affirmation you were writing down or it was visualization and you've thought about that, you've spoken it out loud, like it's done, it's mine. Now, just feel the emotion of gratitude as you say that. End it with a feeling of gratitude and perfect. Okay, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed it in the comment section below and by giving this video a thumbs up and um, subscribe if you haven't already and for my one-on-one -on -one coaching or my online programs that's in the description box below thank you so much for watching um, I hope you have an amazing day what you want is inevitable and I'll see you on the next video